Welcome back to all the fans. Well, welcome back to us really. We were on cruise last week and if you haven't seen the videos yet, take a look. They're somewhere around here. Take a look, just a quick tour of the ship and a little bit of what we did on the beaches of the places we visited. So while we were on cruise, we went on one of the, it was like a snorkeling slash swimming expedition by that beach with the airplanes that come in real low. And there was a guy there that looked, well, he looked a lot like me. <laughs> Dude, that was so you. You know it wasn't me and you know it wasn't. Dude, it's not me, man. Just look at the video. It's you. I have seen the video. We're looking at it right now. That is not me. And you know it's not me. I'm not even that fat. You are that fat. It's okay, man. I love you anyway. Peace and love. Peace and love yourself, hippie. All right, so we're back. Don't interrupt again, hippie. All right. So I saw that guy. I didn't recognize him. He doesn't look like me. Maybe in the facial area, but that's about it. And I was pretty alarmed. So I looked up some better ways to eat and lose weight. And I knew that Adkins was a program that I did a while ago. Lost a lot of weight very quickly. Uh, but, of course, it wasn't a long-term solution. So, now I found this keto diet. Now, is the keto the long-term solution that I'm looking for? I don't know. We're going to find out. Uh, when we came back off a cruise, I was 241 pounds. That's a big-ass number. I know it's a big-ass number. Um, immediately on the diet, of course, everyone loses water weight. Immediately, I'm down to 233 pounds. And that's a total loss of 4 pounds. Something like that. So, <laughs> anyway. So it's a loss of a few pounds. And we're, it's just water weight. I get it. But that's where we're going. So, accompanying the keto, I'm going to also be doing intermittent fasting. Um, intermittent fasting is, scientists are really finding out a lot about it now. That it really helps um, a lot of hormonal issues. Uh, getting older, we have HGH that declines rapidly, so apparently intermittent fasting will boost that up quite a bit and help train the body to consume the fat in the reserves that it already has. So this is what I'm hearing, this is what I'm reading, and this is what we're going to do. Additionally, I bought some weights. I bought some Bowflex weights, those adjustment ones. That's my daughter's fiancé has... A set of these Bowflex adjustable weights. They seem fantastic. He had the 50 pounders or something like that. So I bought the 100 pounders. I'm bigger than he is. So he had the he had a set and the tray that you hold them in, and then a bench. So I went ahead and bought the same stuff, uh, almost exactly the same. And we're gonna start doing some dumbbell workouts. Some biceps, triceps, some chest, some legs. We're going to get into basically doing workouts. And the reason why I'm going to have to do this at home is because my job that I've had for the last three or four years, I, I get up at about 4.30 in the morning. I'm on the road um, driving from city to city, town to town, shop to shop, fixing, selling, and maintaining equipment or installing equipment rather. And uh, while on the road, I'm, I'm eating a lot of fast food because if you put a peanut butter and jelly sandwich in the truck, it's going to be ice in the winter time, or it's just going to be a big mush of crap, uh, in the summer. So I would eat out a lot. Uh, I have more McDonald's frequent flyer miles than anybody and Burger King. Everybody loves those. So with that, I started gaining a pound or two 
but now we have a plan. We're going to get rid of the weight. We're going to start lifting. I still work the job, so I still drive 14, 12, 14 hours a day. I'm outside the house in uniform, in boots, not, not uh, able to go to the gym. So we're going to try doing it here at the house. Now, with that said, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to post a video every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday in a new section on the channel. So don't forget to subscribe, click the bell so that you know when I'm putting out new content, and just stick around. Let's uh, help me out. Give me some feedback, some information, and let me know, and I will be forever grateful. All right, fans, thank you, and we'll see you next time. See ya.